Hello everyone, and thank you so much for joining me. Today I am continuing my TXT journey because last time I reacted to them on YouTube, I reacted to Blue Hour, <clears throat> that era, and I also said there that I would include them as an option in my next new moon poll, which is the monthly poll on my Patreon for all members, since new moon is the lowest tier. And TXT won by two votes. BS BTS were behind, which BTS are now an option in this month's new moon poll, if you're interested. And in the next one, I think I don't want to promise anything because I don't want to overwhelm myself and move too quickly through the eras. But I may include TXT again. Because I know that next era after this is just like a repackage. Well, I don't know that it's just a repackage, but I know it doesn't have that many. It's like two more songs, I think. Maybe three. Either way, I'm so excited to be here. I don't know. I feel like this is the start of the emo era. I feel like we got some hints about the fact that the emo era could be starting uh, during Blue Hour, especially for listening to the B-sides of that. Oh, speaking of B-sides, after this, for Patreon, for New Moon tier, all patrons, all members, I will be doing the comeback show I will be reacting to. So that'll be up by the time you're watching this. Hopefully the first listen to the full album, eight songs this time. I don't know if it's a mini album or a full album. Eight, eight songs, that should be like a full ass album. That's for, it will also be up by this time and it'll be posted for Half Moon patrons and above. And I think that's all I want to say. Consider joining my Patreon if you want to gain access to so much more TXT content. I am enjoying this TXT journey so much. And thank you so much to NVA for helping me with the playlists. As you can see, this is what we're checking out today. We're doing this. First, the, the logo change. And I love the look of this logo. I feel like my t-shirt is kind of matching it. And then the concept trailer. And then we're we're not doing any individual teasers this time, which I trust NVA and also it feels like a good idea. I can watch those afterwards if I want to, or maybe they don't exist. I don't know. And then yeah, just this teaser, then the music video, then choreography, then teaser for magic, and then that music video. I know Frost has a music video as well, but that was released like in October or something later. So I'll be checking that out later, maybe for Patreon, maybe for YouTube. I don't know. We'll see, but I'm very excited to be here. Thank you everyone for joining me. Let's get this show on the road. Here we go. Logo change. Whoa. Blue. This is spacey. Oh my God, the heart is like a little deformed or something why does it look like that how am i matching the logo so much i was like i didn't know what to wear but now oh. trust your gut ladies girls gotta have guts look at these blue diamond splitter splatter like a mirror mirror freeze Hmm. Freeze is a response. We haven't even talked about the title, Freeze. It's like fight or flight. Sometimes you can also freeze. That's like the third, third, third thing that happens. Also just freeze is like when it's cold. I don't know. Oh my God. Look, even my fucking mug matches. That's such an icy sound. Do you hear that? I see that I'm icy. Kim Petra's icy. Love. It's the icy. Love. Oh my god, now is the concept trailer. This one is in 4K. <gasps> 343. What the fuck did I just say, bitch? That was aggressive. I would like to apologize, but yeah, fight or flight. No, the third thing is freeze. <gasps> We're gaming. The end of the fucking world. 
That was a snowball. Ooh, the ice is... Why, why are his knuckles like that? Has he been fighting? Is it because it's cold? Whoa. Well, now we're flighting. Oh my god, it's like a video game is happening. Here. Oh. Wait, is this playing backwards? What? Fierce. Serving icy cunt. No, Kai! <gasps> this is so cool. It's like they're in a video game. It's like they have supernatural icy powers. Oh my god, he looks so good. Oh my god, look at him in the that jacket. Oh my god, he has black hair now. Oh my god. Um, Shiva. Final Fantasy. Yes, that's mother. But you know I didn't die. Okay. I had crystallized. And now I'm a Glamazon bitch ready for the runway. Mother has arrived. Like my gay awakening, her snapping her fingers. And yas. Work! We're about to be snatched. And that's the team. Bitch. Because we're about to serve Slay. My anyway, here we go. This is giving Shiva Final Fantasy. What is this sound? Oh, <gasps> the tattoo. Are they gonna dance now? The ice is still falling. You got me fucked up! Be manhandled. Me next! No! <gasps> Wait, I recognize that. Okay, that is very interesting. Who is she? That's mother. Wait! Sorry? Well, I'm sorry. I don't know, sorry. She's the one featured on the time track. I didn't even talk about that yet. Oh my god, when he fought back against the ice, hitting like the chandelier, which is kind of like this beautiful like glass uh, metal, because sometimes when you're referring to like icy, like jewelry, like you're all iced out. I don't know, what do they, what do they say? It can refer to that. The way the ice was like falling and splattering in the ground was kind of like chandeliers falling as well. Is this what they're fighting back against? I feel like the ice 
one. I have much more things to say. This was like they were playing a fighting game on that video game console in that arcade place. The way this is like reminding me of video games. It's reminding me of Tekken and Final Fantasy, both games that I've grown up. Also, it could be like any other game, but just like personally, that's what it's reminding me of, which is I have always said, but the TXC has reminded me of... Don't get into that. I will, however, get into <sighs> this choreography again, because it was like, girl, they were... Something else I also talk about a lot is how I love choreography and like dancing and martial arts and like fighting. It's feels like very connected to me because it's like they're both kind of like I don't know choreographies things you do with your body and I feel like this choreography really incorporated that and it's just adding to the whole fight or flight or freeze so interesting the way that all of that is paired together him in this in this in this in this in this jacket in this racer jacket look at his necklace it's like two fangs Mm. This choreography, this whole thing was insane. Is this what the title track is gonna sound like? The tattoos on his legs, on his ankles, I just wanna bite them. Uh, am I recording? Oh my god, yes. Mm. I love that. Look at that. That's insane. This one-handed thing. How they're incorporating with the eyes, the added CGI shit. How are they moving in slow motion, but... We need to see that again. How are you outdoing yourself like this since Blue Hour? How are these the same fucking little twinks? It's so cool. My emo boyfriend. It's like they're, he's, it's like Yeonjun is being chased by this ice and they're all trying to like help him avoid it. Is it? And it was fire last time when he would do like, shh, more. And there was more fire, but now it's ice. Uh. I would catch you. That post, though, hmm, I feel like I recognize this. Also, what's the, okay, that's a coin, 2010. It's an old coin, even, the, I don't know where that coin came, came from, flip a coin, like what, and that turns to eyes first. Who the fuck is she? I don't know. That was fucking incredible. Let's move on. Do I need subtitles? No. Uh, one, two, cha cha cha. Who are you dancing with? Ain't nobody around. Why is it like weird bugs are crawling on the screen? I'll have what he's having. Oh, it's fish. 
water. Is it tank gonna turn to ice? Girl, I don't know shit. Say you love me, say you love me, say you get good guys. Oh nothing, I won't Flora Gotan. That, that must be Acne Studios, because I've literally been next to I was staying in it. Okay, never mind. I think that is Acne Studios, because that is on Flora Gotan, Stockholm, Sweden. Oh, that's I love that's that. That's all I saw. Okay, anyway. W what? What was that? Wait, also, I think... Oh, I'm not ready! Wait! This one is 435. 343. Anyway. That pool was in a pool that was empty. We saw an empty pool in... Was that in Can't You See Me? No, it was first in Run Away. It was in Run Away. I'm scared to click play. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. I won't yell in Swedish anymore. So this is the... Oh my god. <laughs> you don't understand how nervous I get. Okay. We're watching this once, once without subtitles and then... How, I don't even know how many times. At least once more, probably. Probably only once more after. And then I can pause as much as I want. I would really try to not pause this time. Oh my god. You don't understand. We're pausing. We have to read this. This better be translated. Oh my god. You can say that adolescence is a whole universally present... You can say that adolescent is a whole, universally pr present in the lives of everyone. Large or small, we experience hunger and emptiness in our soul during this period. Emo. Me. However, to some boys, this hole invades their lives with, with excessive frequency and in complex forms. Kang Yujong. Manhole. <coughs> My grinder profile name. The equ the exquisite metaphor for the whole in life. Okay, whole is just a really funny word to me. It's because I'm Swedish, whatever. Because I I don't know. Never mind. What is it? Swedish doesn't have anything to do. It's just a funny word. The exquisite metaphor for the whole in life. Some sort of void, emptiness, something that's mi missing. Adolescence is that whole. Yeah. Why is it? So, that's why I was emo when I was pre, be, pre, pre what was it when, in my early teens and like I don't know when I was sixteen. What year was that? I'm born in ninety one. Anyway, that's kind of what I cling to, you know. Okay, okay, it's gonna be sad. Love song. And why is it called O X one equals love song? Okay, whatever. Here we go. There's no sound. Oh. I know I love you. Zero is sick, get so gun and your mom won't annoy. You can shift another soul. I can so hold it. What in the just a good test. Playing video games. Oh. oh my god, Stubin!
I'm freaking shaking! I can't! Volvo! Oh my god, I can't the chorus. Is a Volvo Sweden. There she? I forgot to hear her. <laughs> Fire. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sweden really came through with Acne Studios and the Volvo. And only thing missing is fucking IKEA or ABBA. <clears throat> that hole they're talking about. Oh my god. That chorus. I just feel it inside me. It's like so guttural. It like just reaches in to your heart and grabs it and squeezes it. It's like you hear that pain. I think it is taken and and Henning Kai, are they the ones who sing it? It's like when they say lovesick. We have to watch this again. We have to watch this again. Wait, did I watch it with subtitles? Oh my god, I forgot to put the subtitles on. <laughs> I'm still like shaking. Am I? I love this. Emo, coming of age, type shit. Yes. This is also, I'm, just, I'm like out of breath and can't breathe and my heart. It's reminding me of this place. My man and husband and Oh wait, look at this. 
are that is that supposed to like his parents fighting and he's like just playing video games being like a kid or whatever or using video games as a coping mechanism to tune out reality hello literally story of my life wow so holy two meanings He stole his parents' key to their car. They drive a Volvo. Can we talk about how fucking ass, what? How fucking fine Yeonjin looks in this, like the hair style, the hair color, the. Mm. Oh my god, Subin's voice here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is this the same place they are outside later? Does he live there? Is this... It looks, like, abandoned. It's like you can hear, like, the way... I don't know, the raspiness in his voice or whatever you call it. He's just belting it out. Guttural fucking emotions. It's it's so good. It just pierces your heart. Also, I love that line. I know it's real. I can feel it. Volvo! Why do I turn into, like, I don't know, the biggest pro-Sweden ever when I see it? It's not that I'm pro-Sweden. It's because it's, like, fun for me to relate because it's, like, Swedish things. And it's, like, fun for me. So, anyway. Interesting that they show all these fish, all these blue betas, to be specific. And in the music video teaser, I learned this from Luna Lore, bitch. In the teaser, we saw a tank full of goldfish. If you would put a blue beta in a tank with goldfish, it would, like, kill all the goldfish, wouldn't it? Or is it they would kill all the other betas because there can only, like, be one or something? I don't know. Please use me as a drug. What is that? Like, snort me? Like, swallow me? Smoke me? Or just... No, it's, maybe it's like, I want to be... I want you to be, like, addicted to me. I mean, I can... Never mind. I know I love you. Say you love me. Say you love me. Say Bohemkyu's voice and Sori's voice are like combined here, layered, they're like together. I love that those two are in the front seat. <laughs> I didn't even hear her the first time. Girl, I'm so sorry. They push it, the car away. Was he sitting in it? Yeah. Same. <laughs> Let's have a party in hell. Because I'm gay. Because I'm gay. This building. They showed this in eternally. And also that comeback showcase. No, not showcase. Comeback show. They had like some little video, VCR video recorded thing. Uh, uh, video. I shouldn't burp. Some recorded. Yeah. I didn't even light a single match. Hmm. Okay, I, I can't pay attention to the lyrics that much right now. It's very overwhelming. That'll be for the first listen.
Oh my god. Kai. Like the way the way he just oh Literally, I've lived all of these lyrics too. Do you see all that? Especially, you know. Oh my god, the way they keep reminding me of my youth like nobody had. Had? Has. Had. Had. Has. Or maybe ever will. This is not the same location. As in. That other music video. Look at the. There are five blue betas. No, they're not blue betas. These are pink betas. We did see a blue one at some point. What, what was that? So, also, he has like a... Oh my god, he's literally like so beautiful. Oh my god, I fucking can't look at him. I fucking hate him. I'm fucking leaving. I can't. What was I gonna say? Oh, don't look at me! Oh. Like, his arm is broken. Is it supposed to symbolize, like, I don't know, your heart being broken or something? Heartbroken, maybe. You know, when you break your arm or any bone in your body, where it, like, grows back together, it's the strongest part now of that body. Isn't that just a metaphor for healed trauma too, mama? I would say so. But healing is fucking painful, you know? People think, oh, self-care. Oh, I'm going to heal from this. Oh, yeah. And it'll be painful. Okay, sorry. Like, for real, I need to, like, go take a break and cry. <laughs> but I won't. This bridge is so TXT. I can't believe they even said my name like that. Is I want what is this symbolizing? Is this like his coping mechanism again being shown like I know it's real, I can feel it. Is that because, like, I feel like video games are very, like, fantasy world. And you choose a fantasy world. I chose a fantasy world over the real one. Because my real world sucked. And maybe that's what it's about here, seeing the parents fight in the beginning and just being heartbroken or whatever it is. Honestly, like, the way he's dancing is... Mmm. Look at this darkness. Say you love me, say you love me, say can you get the gym? Only nothing I want all love you. Say you love me. God, I fucking hate them. I like love them so much. I hate them. Oh. We're right, fine. Are we fine? Oh. <laughs> I don't understand this part. Full of problems, lovesick. I was fine to die. This. Where did they record this? It wasn't Sweden. No, I would have known about that. Oh my god, why are you on your knees in front of me? Oh. 
There was the fish tank. <clears throat> and look, th when they're in the pool, they're like fishes. I also love the way they sing, like, I want all of you. I love all of you. Like, no matter your imperfections or problems or whatever, your flaws. Well, you woke up again, and the car was not on fire, but your hair's wet. Oh, they got me good, girl. They got me good. I don't have anything to say. I don't want to. Yeah, I fucking love it. I want to see the choreography version, too. Why is this one seven minutes long? Oh. I love that they have mics. I know I love you. Is there a second so gun that your mom won't know? You can chop the nod of so like oh my god, so holy. What a net is a good song, good in a kid of manga. My life for you was a mess. I did not have a panic, you sew up the chest. Oh, we're jogging it, but I guess all I knew it would get in the moon. Now I guess the Yeonjun's voice fits this song like oh thinking about you when I'm sinking alone Wow The fucking pre-chorus is insane the way oh the way it builds up Oh. Another reason I'm crying is like It reminds me of my youth You know My emo days I was so unhappy And I'm so happy That I'm happy now I'm so glad that I came out of it Anyway It's interesting because they show Bomgyu, of course, because he sings this part when she does as well. But it was at some other point where, like, Yeonjun was looking. And then what he saw in the concept trailer that would, like, the shape of this woman with all the white background. I think that was Bomgyu. The way the fucking, whoo, the way the fucking chorus as well. Damn it, you didn't see my kick there when it was really high in the air. The way the chorus also incorporates this, like, this complete feeling of being like, I don't care about anything else in the world but you. You know, that's also, when you love someone that much, and like when you're young, you become this obsessed. I feel like sometimes that can also be like a coping mechanism to filter out everything else and focus on just that. Whatever it is, a drug, a video game, an eating disorder, a person, could be like whatever. Maybe that was like too serious, but like, just speaking from my own experience, like I've done it all. And then some. I don't know if y'all have heard this song before, but it's like so good. That song is so good. Did you know? 
crazy. My love before you was a treasure. Now that I'm able to screw up the mesh away. Oh, I'm burning in this song. The new era get beat now to go. Now I kiss the feel. I feel like Bomgyu is like singing a lot in this and I love it. But you ain't singing no love. Could not damn make it that time I chant. Then you got to know home town. I know it's real I can feel. You kill me every fucking time with this part take. Then you got to know home town. No Gaga. Uh. Doesn't look like you do. You look like you're just fine there with Yeonjun. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I had jeans just like this with my thighs out. Yes, please, motherfucker, bitch. I know I love you. Zero is sick, it's so gonna get Never in my life I'm gonna what? Never in my life am I gonna get sick of hearing this voice. And this song, I mean, this song I meant, was meant to say, but this voice also, but this song. Cheers to that, bitch! This is happening.
the emotion they have while they're performing this. Every little bit of movement in this choreography, they're pouring their hearts out with their bodies, with their movements, dancing. No Gaga, yes Gaga. Oh my god. That ad lib. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> this is insane. This is crazy as insane. <laughs> this is crazy and insane and fucking lunatic. See, lunacy tick, tick. What? Okay. Okay. That was. We're supposed to move on to a new song now. That's called Magic. Magic. I feel like all the titles this time around have like, like, sh like referencing previous songs. Like Magic, kind of like Magic Island. Uh, yeah. And then we have that one. What if I had been that Puma, which is like Puma. And then we have that one, No Rules, which is kind of like New Rules, but now it's No Rules. What else do we have? Frost. One of them we'll call Sputnik. Sputnik? Sput? Sput? Is that a satellite? Whatever. We'll, we'll get to that in the first listen. Now we're just doing this. Like, I'm trying to pretend I missed it. I'm trying to pretend that I'm, like, ready and prepared for this and willing to move on. But I'm not. I still feel like crying. What the fuck? Tomorrow by Together News. We have breaking news that the resistance tomorrow by Together, who has been threatening our own robot humanity, has finally been arrested. Girl, this is a gay Star Wars. What? These outfits, the all blue, these blue soundproof things. Oh my God, that's what I want my background to look like. These all blue soundproof things. I don't know what to call them other than that. Uh, I should do that. Why am I burping so much? Oh, I love, I love this styling. Star Wars gay version, like for real. It sounds like, I just think magic. It's like, we'll leave you standing by yourself. <coughs> Dropkick by N Team. Obviously, this came out first. Let's just do this one with subtitles right away because I don't know how much I can take. I'm like, There's no subject. Tomorrow, I together who has been threatening our robot humanity.
a robot humanity. What the fuck is that? Remember how we used to be so stuck in one place so cold. They've been oh they've been trapped, arrested. Abducted by aliens. Sometimes when I have really weird dreams, I'm like, oh, is that what happened last night? And now they like erase my memory. Anyway, just me. This is fun. His red hair. <laughs> Give it me life. <laughs> Girl, we are turning up in this spaceship. Used to be so afraid, afraid of all the Wait, is it all in English? It is. Did that say public execution? <laughs> what? Oh, they are wearing straight jackets. I just kind of noticed that. <clears throat> I mean, I feel like I noticed it, but I didn't like register. This is so weird to watch after the pre the other one. What is what is going on with Yonjin in this era? Oh my god! It's it's like when he has that hair. I think it's the undercut. Is that what it's called, girl? This is cute. <laughs> I love this weird auto tune. It's very fitting for this concept. This music video, so they they didn't get executed. Did they execute everyone else? It feels a bit like though with a song like this, like all in English. It feels like it's trying to cater to like an international audience to like lure them in or something. Kind of with the the way the song sounds and just like I don't really know, but I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to hear it again. But I feel like even though it's a good song, but it's like when I hear that it kind of sounds like that. I feel like it's that back for more. Do it like this. Since I have heard those songs, I'm getting that vibes, and that just puts me off. That there's no like there's no magic in that for me, unfortunately. Even though it's called magic, but that kind of ruins the magic for me. I want TXT to be. A, unapologetically txt and it doesn't feel like that to me but maybe that's just because of my impression of 
TXT and what I prefer the most with TXT. But I mean, it's still like a fine, catchy song. I think I would like it more if it wasn't all in English. Because I feel like the music video is really fun. But I'm not in a funny mood after what I've gone through. That was really emotional. I think I need to recover from that a bit. But I really enjoyed it. As I said in the beginning, I'm going to go check out the comeback show and do a first listen. And I feel like I want to do that just now. Please do check over check my Patreon in the links in the description if you want to see that, if you're interested in that. Other than that, thank you for watching this with me. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. I can't wait to start checking out more from this era. I don't even know what happened, but it's been like 55 minutes. So please like this video if you did. And subscribe if you want to, but only if you want to. I love you all. Goodbye.